Hi guys and welcome back to another short and sweet three minute cooking video. If this is your first time here, welcome again. Thank you so much for joining me. If you wanna learn how to make this instant pot chicken tortilla soup, which is to die for, make sure you stay tuned for all of the ingredients. And if you haven't already, I would love it if you subscribe to my channel. Um, that's all I have to say. Let's get on into the video. First things first, I'm gonna go ahead and put four cups of water into my Instant Pot, and then I'm gonna be using a 14.5 ounce can of diced tomatoes with Italian herbs right into that. I'll be using one heaping tablespoon of chili powder, one heaping tablespoon of cumin, one heaping teaspoon of oregano, and one of paprika. Also three bay leaves, and then to go with the four cups of water, we'll also be using four teaspoons of this chicken flavored bouillon. I'll also be adding some black pepper and salt to taste. Then I added two sliced jalapenos, one medium chopped onion, one tablespoon of minced garlic, and about a quarter cup of chopped cilantro. I'm also adding six pieces of frozen chicken thighs, and I think I had a couple in there that had the bone in there, but the rest of them were boneless, skinless. Then I set my Instant Pot to 15 minutes and set it aside. I also took a stack of tortillas and I cut them in thin strips, and then after that I cut them in threes. I had my pot of oil heating up on the stove once it was all heated up. I went ahead and just took one of these big spoonfuls of the tortillas and just fried them. You want to make sure that they're nicely cooked so when they're ready they're going to be a nice golden brown. You just want to have a nice crunch to it and then I'm going to go ahead and take the chicken out and chop it up. While I do that I did go ahead and put two of these 15 ounce cans of black beans and then two cups of frozen corn and then I just put it all into the liquid. After I chopped off chopped up the chicken I went ahead and put it back into the pot and set it for five more minutes and garnish with some cheese, sour cream, avocado, a little bit more cilantro, and some lime juice, and we're all set. Oh my gosh, it's gonna make my mouth water. You guys, this is so delicious, and I really hope you guys try it out. If you did enjoy this video, make sure you leave me a thumbs up, leave any comments, questions down below. Again, make sure to subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye!